We are now with Eurotorp, who is showcasing uh, the famous uh, Mu-90 lightweight torpedo. Uh, Guy, good afternoon. Thanks for welcoming us on your booth. Good afternoon. Thank you uh, very much for this interview. So can you please uh, first tell us uh, what's uh, Eurotorp, what, it's, what is its uh, role? Yeah, sure. So Eurotorp is a European consortium. It has been uh, created uh, 30 years ago. It was a decision from the French and Italian government to create a French-Italian uh, company in order to develop uh, a common global uh, lightweight torpedo program. So regarding the industry uh, work share, so Leonardo is 50% uh, of uh, your top, and for France, uh, Naval Group and uh, Antares. So once uh, that uh, was uh, put in place, uh, we have started the development of the Mu-19 and we succeeded to, to develop what is the best reference, the unique lightweight torpedo on the worldwide scale. So we have had um, many uh, success. So today uh, we can say that uh, 13 navies are equipped with, uh, with the Mu-90. Some are NATO countries, some not. Uh, most of them are uh, top rank uh, level of uh, navies. Uh, France, Italy, uh, Germany, Australia, but also uh, more recently uh, Saudi Arabia, Qatar, uh, Emirates as well, and, uh, and Greece. And what's the latest news uh, with the Mu-90 uh, program? We have uh, had uh, notified a big, uh, very big contract with OCAR for uh, France, Italy, uh, Germany and Australia. Uh, very important because it is the first time that Australia enters in, uh, in, in OCAR, in a program. So it's very, very important for the community. Otherwise, we have uh, uh, decided uh, in Eurotop and its members to, to give uh, a new boost to, uh, to Eurotop that was decided last year. Uh, two main axes for that. The first one is the commercialization of the community on the worldwide scale. That is why we are today here in a in index and the second very important axis as well is to uh, propose a uh, research and development roadmap. Uh, however, main objective in Eurotop uh, is always to, to keep at the top level of performance the Mu-90. That is the case today, but uh, we, if, if we don't invest now, the competitors and uh, other navies could have uh, some uh, uh, performance uh, torpedoes as well. So we want to keep the uh, the, the, the best performances for our navies in order for them to always have an uh, op operational advantage. That is very important for, for your job. Alexi, can you tell us about the technical specification of the Mu-90? As you may know, the Mu-90 uh, lightweight torpedo is the best performing uh, lightweight torpedo on the market. It has been originally uh, developed to meet the stringent operational requirements of both uh, French and Italian navies so that the weapon system would be able to cope with all the threats that you can encounter underwater uh, during the 21st uh, century. The weapon system is uh, capable of defeating any kind of a submarine, ranging from deep diving, fast evading uh, nuclear submarines up to the uh, mid-jet uh, type uh, submarines or uh, underwater unmined uh, vehicles evolving in uh, very shallow waters. Can you share with us some of the performance figures? With more than 12 kilometers uh, at uh, maximum speed of uh, range, so the maximum speed being beyond uh, 50 knots, you have this standoff uh, engagement uh, capability, which is twice as uh, the competition. Regarding the lethality of the weapon, uh, it is the only uh, lightweight torpedo uh, which is fitted with a shape charge which uh, grants any submarine destruction at any uh, operational depth. It has been proven able to penetrate any kind of double hulled, including double hulled reinforced with titanium. Uh, it has also adaptability built uh, in its design uh, to make it evolve in accordance with the operational uh, requirements and also the evolving SW uh, threats. The first uh, add-on functionality that uh, Eurotorp has uh, engaged in line with uh, our parents uh, authorities is the hard kill uh, functionality from surface ship. This uh, feature will be unique in its kind because it will provide on this effector, so from one single effector, a dual capability, anti-submarine warfare and hard kill capability, so I mean anti-torpedo-torpedo. -torpedo. 
Uh, this uh, will be unique uh, on the market and uh, the program uh, has already been uh, activated. The operational advantages will be multiple for the users' navies because uh, they will not have to change any of the existing uh, launching systems on board uh, the platforms. Uh, they will have uh, one single effector providing uh, defense capability against uh, submarines or heavyweight torpedo uh, threats and also the capability to, to shift in uh, offensive deliberate attack uh, mode. The threats uh, that will be treated in uh, hard kill mode will be uh, all the heavyweight torpedo for which there is uh, no possibility of avoiding uh, today uh, such as advanced uh, heavyweight uh, acoustics uh, torpedo, auto-guided or uh, wire-guided, but also, which is very important, the wake-homing uh, torpedoes for which there is absolutely no parade existing uh, on the market. The time frame for this program is uh, five years and uh, we are very confident in line with uh, both French and uh, Italian uh, authorities uh, to, uh, to develop and qualify uh, the system including sea trials against uh, real targets uh, at, the end of the, at the end of the process.